Com. Well, the opening ceremony for Balloon Fiesta launches tomorrow, so let's check in with First Alert meteorologist Byron Morton on what the weather looks like. And of course, if there's food around, you know Byron's going to find it. He's live at Balloon Fiesta Park. Hi, Byron. Hey there, Will. You won't believe it. We were just sitting here, my photojournalist and myself, Tony Sabato, sitting here, and all of a sudden, first the uh, Blake's Lotta Burger ladies came over with some burritos, and of course we downed those in two seconds. They gave us this frisbee too. But uh, the Rex's hamburger guy came over and gave us this green chili cheeseburger. Now you can't tell me that your mouth is not watering for this right now, and you can see that there's not much action going on. They're shutting the doors right now, but they are gearing up for a big day tomorrow, and right now. Things are looking good. Let's check out that mass ascension forecast for Balloon Fiesta Park tomorrow morning on your Saturday, and it will be chilly. Temperatures in the 40s, so yes, you'll need the jackets, the coats, dress in layers, as we always say. Those breezes look to be in check, especially at the surface. We're talking about winds anywhere from 5 to 10 miles per hour. There could be some stronger winds aloft, and it does look like that the balloons will first float south and then maybe to a southeasterly direction, and it doesn't look like there's going to be a box tomorrow, but overall, it's looking like a great mass. Ascension for the first Saturday of Balloon Fiesta. And of course, we will have live coverage out here tomorrow morning. 75 degrees in Albuquerque. Beautiful evening shaping up with clear blue skies. And it looks like that's going to be the trend throughout the night for tonight. Let's check out the temperatures across New Mexico in the 60s and 70s for most of the state throughout the day with a few 80s popping up down south. Nothing but sunshine for areas of New Mexico. Now, the winds, of course, are a big concern for Balloon Fiesta and for all areas of New Mexico through your weekend. And right now, as I mentioned, look Looks good to start the day off tomorrow morning and throughout the events tomorrow. But by tomorrow afternoon, we are going to see those breezes cranking up at about 10 to 15 miles per hour for us here in Albuquerque and could be a little bit stronger, especially along and east of the central mountain chain and as areas further off to the north over the northern mountains as well. Sunday, it looks like those winds will subside through the day. Temperatures will be on the mild to warm side for all parts of New Mexico. Let's break it down for you region by region, beginning with the southeastern part of the state after a chilly night tonight. Lows in the 40s and 50s. We'll have Highs in the 70s and 80s from Rodoso into Carlsbad, Hobbs for tomorrow. Lots of sunshine, a bit of a breeze during the afternoon. Less of a breeze for southwest New Mexico, and temperatures will be warming into the 70s and 80s there with lots of sunshine. Up to the four corners, you're going to have to get through a pretty cold night. Lows mostly in the 30s from Durango into Farmington, Chinle, Gallup, and Grants. Highs rebounding in the 70s tomorrow, but we'll see those northwest breezes 10 to 20 miles per hour. And Santa Fe down to 40 tonight, but much colder. Red River into Taos in the 20s and 30s. Highs in the 60s and 70s tomorrow with those breezes. And Raton, Las Vegas into the East Mountains, Edgewood, Moriarty, and Santa Rosa. Highs in the 70s and 80s tomorrow. So warmer day after a cold night. Temperatures will be much warmer for tomorrow. And throughout the metro, those lows in the 40s and 50s for tonight with highs in the 70s and 80s tomorrow. Those breezes out of the west about 10 to 15 miles per hour. 43 the valley, 48 the heights. The seven-day planner shows that we are going to see a bit of a breeze each afternoon, the next couple of afternoons for the first weekend of Balloon Fiesta. But I do think things are looking good for the mass ascensions. We will keep a very close eye on those winds above the surface, not only for tomorrow, but again for Sunday. But right now, if we can just bottle up the weather we have right now, we're in good shape. Blake's a lot of burgers. He's going to love me for this. But uh, yeah, looking great here from Balloon Fiesta Park. And it looks quiet right now. It's going to be a much different situation this weekend. So are there volunteers behind you now getting things ready for tomorrow? Oh, yeah. And I don't know if you can hear it, Royal, but uh, over my shoulder here, they are putting up uh, more scaffolding, it looks like, and some type of signage that's going up here on this corner vendor. There are uh, about, uh, what, I believe 38 food vendors here at Bloom Fiesta Park and 90 some odd merchandise vendors. So a lot of different vendors. Everybody's setting up. They're putting the finishing touches on the main stage as well. Things are getting ready, and I tell you, the food is delicious, so you don't want to miss it. We'll have live coverage, of course, tomorrow morning. Okay, sounds well. good. Thanks, Byron. Well, Ebola.